what's up everybody welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today i'm going to show you and unbox united states survival kit pilot over the water hot climate so it's a little suitcase backpack type of kit really really heavy i would say about 50 60 pounds easily I'm not really sure what inside of it i got it on ebay so let's open it up see what we get okay it says that here pull here to release i'm kind of scared what am i trying to release it i guess to release this thing and then to open it like that so this is about 40 year old survival kit oh wow check this out united states military machete boom wow this is so unique look how old this is looks like it's been definitely used which is fine let's see what's inside these things oh wow look at that magnifying glass with paper to start the fire obviously this is super cool look at that inside here there's couple of things this is such a unique no way look at that sharpening stone to sharpen it up a machete and stuff like that look how awesome that is so there's two pockets in, the, in here one for here one for here okay what is this we have some wooden in here life raft retainer whoa that's so cool and date right here may 1989 so about 30 years plus that's cool looks like we got top looks like a top but right here explains you how to use it for use with survival kits may be used as a signal because orange one and if you flip it over a camouflage cloth put it on the ground i guess sunshade or tent or for catching drinking water so pretty much they said everything about what top would do thank you so much for letting us know because that's pretty obvious anyways but that's kind of funny that they included in the video i mean into the kit the explanation look at that i have to pull this out there's a rope right here i guess that would hold this whole kit together this is definitely old school military stuff right here so unique look at this carabiners so we got the shelter we got the knife now oh wow check this out a mosquito head look like a bee beekeeping whale head <laughs> check this out camouflage flip it over head reversible sun and so that way they can see you as well very unique no way this is like for puddling because i'm pretty sure this is actually a life craft let's open it up does it blow up look at that yep this is like one of those tubes life crafts and yeah you can put it inside one of these things cool so in case you land it over the water you have the paddles to swim with pretty cool storage drinking water that's what i thought it would be whoa check this out i have put to the test this a while back emergency drinking water and i actually test the water it was fine and i even drank it and look at that you can open it and seal it like this so that way you can continue rushing it and drink it slowly that's why it comes with one of these cans what else we have here sunscreen sunburn type of stuff polycraft i think this is like a life craft the this one like a patch or something okay what else we have here this saw is capable of cutting metal wood plastic so this side right here inside uh, 30 years ago it was sealed and we're gonna unseal it right now no way <laughs> this is one of those hand saw and it's 
capable to cut wood and metal and stuff like that. I can't believe it. For best result in use, so stainer shown in the diagram above. So you gotta stain it like that. Pretty cool, very, very unique. I love unboxing stuff that been inside of the package for 30, 40 years or longer. So awesome. Okay, what's in here? Oh, compress field tablets. That stuff you can cook with. I'm not gonna open that. Fire starter. No way. Let's unbox it. See what kind of fire starter this is. Wow, I seen those. Look at that, mint condition. This is so cool. They have reproduced this so nicely. So what you do is take it right here and this you got pretty awesome bowls. UCO, fire starters and survival kits make those all the time. So very, very nice. You know what, I'm gonna put it back. That's so cool how it comes in a package like that. Looks like a wire. So much stuff, that's legit, legit stuff. Check this out. To ignite this signal, US Navy signal smoke and illumination. Wow. I'm not going to use those because they're pretty old and could be expired, but that's pretty awesome. So you got here two giant signals. Okay, what is this big stuff over here? Disaster kit seawater mark 2 type 2. This kit contains eight packs of chemicals on plastic bag and one cord tape for in the bag. Each pack of chemicals when mixed with seawater in the plastic bag makes about one pint of drinking water. Wow, so you can actually use this stuff turning seawater into drinking water. I don't know about that, but it's pretty crazy. It looks like we have three of them. What is this? Matches wood. None safety strike anywhere. So strike, strike anywhere matches. Can you believe this? Look at this container. Wow. Wow, look at this old, old matches. Wooden matches too. And you got here stack and you are tips. They don't make them as much anymore. Especially like that. Beautiful. I really like the waterproof container. So unique. It's gotta be collectible item right here. Okay, what is this? Net clean fishing. So fishing net. I'm not gonna open that because it's nice and sealed. But as you can see, a real big fishing net. This is what I'm talking about. This is a survival kit with some epic stuff. The plastic spoon. Oh, no way, look at that. A can opener and a bottle opener. So nice, you can use this right here to pop a hole in and that way you can drink it without opening it all the way. Just kind of make a little hole. Very nice. What is this? A whistle. This is one of those emergency blanket tents type of deal. That's pretty cool. Can't believe it, it's in the military survival kit. This is a repair kit. Oh, no way. Looks like it's been opened. Nice. Look at this fancy, fancy, shiny pliers. Wow. That is so cool. What else we got here? Not really sure. Some kind of repair kit. Anyways, super unique stuff right here too. Gonna put it back in, but there is explanation how to repair stuff. Maybe a hole or something. And what is this? Emergency mirror. Whoa! I can't believe how big this is. Nowadays you get these things, they are really, really tiny. They are like this big. This is huge. That is so cool. You all know what it is. It's just uh, reflecting the sun into the aircraft. There is instructions how to use them and stuff. And one more item over here. Magnetic compass. Cool, 30 years old compass. Let's see what this looks like. 
US military compass. Wow, that is cool compass. That has to work for sure. But yeah, beautiful. Will it point the same direction? Yeah, a lot of times you buy those compasses, they do not point the same direction. They just continue spinning. You see, I just hit it, it goes back where it's supposed to. Obviously, you want to lay it on a flat surface, but it is awesome. Beautiful compass, gonna put it back in. Wow, what a beautiful survival kit. Military 1989 survival kit. Beautiful. Easy, but such a unique stuff. I love the match case, I love the net. I wish survival kits would have this kind of stuff nowadays. Especially these two giant military grade flares. You know, it's amazing. I never seen anything like that. Ignite this end for day use, ignite this end for night use. Wow, this is definitely one of a kind flares. I'm gonna try to open this real carefully. And guess what? There's a flare with a string. Probably on the other side, it will look just the same. I'm gonna close it back up. Wow, very, very unique. Why don't I open this carefully? Boom, you got right here also a pull string. Beautiful, never seen anything like that. Just gonna put it back away. Don't like using those kind of things whenever they've been that old. Also, check out that metal casing. It's so heavy, this is why it is really, really heavy because it just has so much unique stuff. I like it. Boom, look how easy it is to put everything away back up. I know the choice is about this little backpack, but I guess it keeps everything together nice and tight. I figured it out what it was saying, pull here to release, you pull it all the way out and then you just release the whole thing like that. You don't even have to unzip it, you just release it all the way, boom, and just pull it out. Then put it back to this edge, if you wanna zip it, pull it all the way back and uh, zip it. Also, there is something over here. Let's find out what it is it. No way. Food pocket survival. Can you believe that? How many of them? Looks like there is three pieces in there. I'm not gonna take them all out, but you know what? I'm gonna open one just to see what's in there. Yep, that's what I was expecting. Super lightweight one of those bars. You got here a couple of bars, then you have here sugar, another sugar, and I think you have two more bars. Interesting. How you got a couple of sugars. Wow, look at that. More sugar, and you got here coffee. And what is this? And I think this is instant broth chicken flavor. Wow, interesting, and another sugar. Did not expect to see like a mini MRE inside of this survival kit. This is such a crazy aluminum and lightweight. Super unique, I love it.